fast. If your life is wrong, your faith will not rise. Because there are some people that pray and fast, pray, and they are still afflicted because they are very suspicious. Listen to me. This is one lesson that the Lord is not long. The Lord has been teaching me. If you are a suspicious person, you cannot have faith. You are married. You are always suspecting your husband. You are always suspecting your wife. Somebody give you food, you can't eat it. You are living in suspicion. Suspicion everywhere. Suspicion. Someone, somebody gives you a what? Somebody gives you a notebook. You say maybe they want you to steal my glory. Your faith cannot rise. Because that's the thing of unbelief. Are you understanding what I'm saying? So you deal with the spirit of suspicion. Kill it. Some people are suspecting that their mother is a witch. Yes. All of a sudden, maybe they had two dreams. And let me tell you what it's about dreams. You better be careful with dreams. You know why the Bible says your old men shall dream dreams? Because it takes spiritual maturity to receive messages through dreams. It's a very hackable channel. When you eat pounded yam, and it goes through by 10 o'clock, it can influence your dreams. Yes. You watch horror film, you will dream about it. So you think the devil cannot give you dreams? Sometimes the devil wants to destroy some relationships in your life. He will just bring a dream. You see the person, the person looking like a witch, pursuing you. You say, hey, hey, hey. And maybe that relationship is a key to something great that God wants to do for you. It takes spiritual maturity to handle dreams because it's very hackable so it says your old men shall dream dreams say your young men shall see vision the thing about vision is that vision requires it has a higher level of spiritual encryption encryption that's why it's difficult to see visions it's easier to dream dreams but there's a level at which we pray that you see visions your eyes will be opened if you are filled with